Castile and Leon, Leonese, Castiella y Leon, Castijaiion, Galician, Castella y Leon, Castilla y Leon, Portuguese, Castella y Leo is an autonomous community in northwestern Spain. It was constituted in 1983, although it existed for the first time during the First Spanish Republic in the 19th century. Leon first appeared as a kingdom in 910, whilst the Kingdom of Castile gained an independent identity in 1065 and was intermittently held in personal union with Leon before merging with it permanently in 1230. It is the largest autonomous community in Spain and the third largest region of the European Union, covering an area of 94,223 square kilometers with an official population of around 2.5 million. The Organic Law of Castile and Leon, under the Spanish Constitution of 1978, is the bi-region statute of autonomy. The statute lays out the basic laws of the region and defines a series of essential values and symbols of the inhabitants of Castile and Leon, such as their linguistic patrimony, as well as their historic, artistic, and natural patrimony. Other symbols alluded to are the coat of arms, flag, and banner. There is also allusion to a regional anthem, though as of 2013 none has been adopted. It is the region of the world with the most World Heritage Sites, eight in total. April 23rd is designated Castile and Leon Day, commemorating the defeat of the Comuneros at the Battle of Villalá during the revolt of the Comuneros. In 1521, Geography Castile and Leon is bordered by Portugal and Galicia to the west and by Asturias and Cantabria to the north. Aragon, the Basque country and La Rioja is to the east and the border to the south is with Madrid, and with Castile-La Mancha and Extremadura to the southwest. Castile and Leon is in the Meseta Central, a plateau in the middle of the northern half of the Iberian Peninsula. The Spanish part of the Douro River Basin is nearly coterminous. There is also El Bierzo and Lachana, Vale de Mena, and the Vale del Tietar. Very secluded mountain valleys including some from neighboring valleys and stretches terrain much of its territory consists of a large, central plateau, the Meseta. Its height lies between 700 to 1,000 meters. In the north are the mountains of the provinces of Palencia and Leon, with high, spindly peaks and the mountains of the province of Burgos, divided in two by the Pancorbo, leading from Castile to the Basque country. Of those two parts, the more northerly belongs to the Cantabrian mountains and continues to the city of Burgos. The mountains of the east and southeast are part of the system Iberico. In the northeast are the mountains of Zamora, whose peaks have been eroded into mesas. In the east, the mountains of Soria are also part of the system Iberico, including its highest peak, San Miguel 2,314 meters in the Monjayo Massif separating the northern Meseta from the southern and from Castile-La Mancha and Madrid. The system of central includes the Sierra de Gata and the Sierra de Grados in the western half and the Sierra de Guadarrama and Sierra de Jarelon in the eastern half. Rivers The most prominent hydrographic feature of Castile and Leon is the River Duro and its tributaries. The Douro runs 897 kilometers from its headwaters in the Picos de Urbian in Soria to its mouth at the Portuguese city of Porto. Flowing into the Douro from the north, on its right bank, are the Pisurga, the Val de Rajui and the Ezela, its most capacious tributaries. And from the east, on its left bank, the lesser flows of the Adaja and Juratan. After passing the city of Zamora, the Douro flows through a canyon in the Aribes del Duero Natural Park where it constitutes the border with Portugal, flowing north. From its left bank, it receives the waters of such important tributaries as the Tormes, Hubra, Agueda, the Coa and the Piva, all originating in the Sistema Central. From the right bank, it receives the waters of the Saba, the Tua and the Tamega, originating in the Galician Massif. Beyond the Aribes, the Douro turns west, flowing through Portugal to the Atlantic. 
The Ebro passes through part of the provinces of Palencia and Burgos on its way from Fontiba to the Mediterranean. Although the Ebro itself doesn't pass through the province of Soria, some right bank tributaries of Ebro River, like, for example, the Jalan, pass through the province of Soria. The Sil, the most important river in Albierzo, flows into the Minho. There are also rivers flowing to the Targus, like, for example, the Allegan, the Albish and the Tie Acute Tar, the Sela and the Kes, both of them flowing from sources in the north of the province of Leon flow to the Cantabrian Sea. The river Cadagua flows to the estuary of Bilbao from its source in the north of the province of Burgos lakes and reservoirs besides these rivers. The Douro Basin also has a great number of lakes and lagoons, such as the Laguna Negra, in the Picos de Urbian, the Laguna Grande in Grados, the Sanabria Lake in Zamora or the Laguna de la Nava in Palencia. There are also a great number of reservoirs, fed by the snows and rains in the mountains and by glacial meltwater. Despite having relatively little rainfall, Castile and Leon has one of Spain's largest quantities of water held in reserve. Climate The highest rainfall is found in Leon, with a yearly average of 556 mm, whilst Palencia has the lowest amount. Regional administration and government Castile and Leon is divided into nine provinces. Avila, Burgos, Leon, Palencia, Salamanca, Segovia, Soria, Valladolid, Zamora. Each of these provinces is named after its respective provincial capital. Autonomous executive The executive of Castile and Leon is known as the Junta de Castilla y Leon in Spanish. It has one head of the regional executive, the president of the Junta of Castile and Leon, and 12 departments, two vice presidencias and 10 ministries. Seat of the regional executive, neighborhood of Coveriza, Valladolid. Seat of the Accounting Committee, Palencia, Regional Legislature The Cortes of Castile and Leon is the elected legislature of the autonomous community. The tradition of the regional courts is traced back to the Royal Council of Leon. The Curia Regis was a king's summons of the estates of the realm. Although the practical outcome of the Curia Regis of 1188 is still disputed, its charter seems to be an early movement towards the rule of constitutional law. The regional courts meet in Valladolid. Three parties have parliamentary representation in Castile and Leon. Partido Popular de Castilla y Leon associated with the National Centre-Right People's Party, 53 seats in the regional courts, 18 seats in the Cortes Generalis. Partido Socialista de Castilla y Leon associated with the National Centre-Left Spanish Socialist Workers' Party, 29 seats in the regional courts, 14 seats in the Cortes Generalis. Union del Pueblo Leonese Leonese Regionalist Party, one seat in the regional courts, United Left Spanish Left Wing Coalition, one seat in the regional courts in other party, the left of Centre Castilian Nationalist Tierra Comunera, ACAL, has contested previous elections and has held seats in the regional courts in the past, but as of 2011 it is not represented in that body. Flag and coat of arms. The flag of Castile and Leon and coat of arms of Castile and Leon each show the quartered coats of arms of Castile, represented by a castle, and Leon, represented by a lion. The seal is topped with a royal crown. Culture. Languages besides the dominant Castilian Spanish, three other regional languages figure in the linguistic patrimony of Castile and Leon. Two of these are recognized explicitly in the Statute of Autonomy. The Leonese language, according to the statute, will be the object of specific protection for its particular value in the linguistic heritage of the community. The Galician language, according to the statute, merits respect and protection in the places where it is habitually used, which is effectively to say the portions of the comarca of El Bierzo and Sanabria bordering Galicia. In addition, although unmentioned in the statute, in the comarca of El Ribola in the province of Salamanca, P. 
people speak a variety of extreme Maduran known as Abla del Ribola. Education Universities Public University of Burgos University of Leon University of Salamanca University of Valladolid National University of Distance Education Private Catholic University of Avila Miguel de Cervantes European University i.e. University Pontifical University of Salamanca Sport Real Valladolid is the main football club in Castile and Leon. Notable cyclists from the region are Pedro Delgado and Roberto Harris, winners of the Vuelta a España. History Castile and Leon traces its history to the medieval kingdoms of Castile and Leon, which were permanently united under the crown of Castile in 1301. Together with other Christian-ruled Iberian kingdoms, the separate monarchies of Castile and Leon participated in the Reconquista, the reconquest of Iberia from the Moors, its medieval Muslim rulers. The first dynastic union of Leon and Castile came about in 1037, when Ferdinand, the 20-year-old Count of Castile, defeated his brother-in-law Bermudo III of Leon in battle and claimed the crown of Leon through the rights of his own wife, Sancha, Bermudo's sister. Although he declared himself Emperor of all Spain in 1056, the union ended with Ferdinand's death in 1065, when Castile, Leon, and Galicia each passed to a different one of Ferdinand's sons in certain cities to his daughters, with a further division of spheres of influence in the Muslim taifas. The arrangement did not hold. The sons soon fought, eventually one son. Alfonso VI of Leon again created an effective union and in 1077 again claimed the title of Emperor of all Spain. However, his death in 1109 left the kingdoms again disunited. Alfonso VII managed another personal dynastic union from 1126 until his death in 1157. Finally, Ferdinand III of Castile, later canonized, achieved the definitive union of the two crowns. After Ferdinand's father Alfonso IX of Leon died in 1230, Ferdinand, already ruler of Castile, conquered Leon from his own half-sisters Sancha and Dolce, much against the desires of the Leonese clergy and nobility. His son and successor Alfonso X, unusually highly educated for a monarch of that era, established Castilian as a language of learning and culture, beginning the process by which the Castilian language would become the dominant language of much of Spain, with other languages, including Leonese, increasingly seen as local dialects. The medieval Cortes of Leon is one of the earliest ancestors of Europe's parliaments. The remote origins of the Cortes date back to the early 12th century. The Cortes of Leon of 1188, called by Alfonso IX is one of the earliest documented gatherings of the estates in which commoners of the cities and towns are represented beside the clergy and nobility as councillors to the monarch. Alfonso gathered similar assemblies in 1202 in Benevente and 1208 in Leon, in the Kingdom of Castile. The first curia, a large assembly to address the affairs of the kingdom, appears to have been convoked by Alfonso VIII in 1187 at San Esteban de Gormas, with the leading men of 50 cities in attendance. In his capacity as King of Castile, Ferdinand III received the homage of large delegations at Valladolid in 1217 and convoked a curia in 1219 at Burgos. Valladolid was home to a number of Castilian kings between the 12th and 17th centuries. Antecedents to the autonomous community Spain has alternated between regionalism and centralization several times in the last century and a half. In 1869, the republicans of the present Castile and Leon plus the provinces of Santander and Logroño had drafted the Castilian Federal Pact, which projected the creation of a federated state under the name Castilla la Vieda in these 11 provinces. During the First Republic, the Republican Democratic Federal Party intended to make this a reality. 
However, the fall of the Republic at the beginning of 1874 put an end to this initiative. In 1921, on the fourth centenary of the Battle of Villalar, the municipal government of Santander, Cantabria advocated for the establishment of a Castilian Commonwealth of these same eleven provinces. In late 1931 and early 1932, the priest Eugenio Moreno, in Leon, wrote a piece for the Diario de Leon stating a basis for Castilian Leonese regionalism. During the Second Republic, especially in 1936, there was a great deal of regionalist activity favorable to a region of 11 provinces including the elaboration of the basis of a statute of autonomy. The Diario de Leon advocated for the formalization of this initiative and the constitution of an autonomous region as follows. To unite in one personality Leon and Old Castile around the Great Basin of the Douro, without falling now into simple village rivalries, the establishment of a centralizing regime after the Spanish Civil War brought an end to these aspirations for regional autonomy. After the death of the dictator Francisco Franco unleashed the Spanish transition to democracy, there was an upwelling of Castilian Leonese regionalist, autonomist and nationalist organizations, such as Alianza Regional de Castilla y Leon, Instituto Regional de Castilla y Leon and the Autonomic Nationalist Party of Castile and Leon. None of these survive today, but similar sentiments are now represented by Unidad Regionalista de Castilla y Leon. Forming the autonomous community Castile and Leon obtained a pre-autonomic regime by the Royal Decree late 21978, June 13, 1978. This set the region on the course toward establishing an autonomous community a path that had been offered first to Catalonia toward the end of 1977 and would eventually be granted to every part of Spain. Five years later, in 1983, the autonomous community of Castile and Leon was made concrete by the Statute of Autonomy accepted by both the community and the Spanish state. The Provincial Deputation of Leon agreed on April 16, 1980 to endorse the Castilian Leonese process, but then revoked that support January 13, 1983, just as the proposed organic law was before the Spanish Parliament. The Constitutional Court of Spain upheld the first of these two contradictory Leonese resolutions. The court's decision was met by demonstrations in Leon and elsewhere in the Leonese territories in favor of a policy of Leon solo. The roughly 90,000 people who gathered in Leon at that time constituted the largest demonstration in that city between the revival of democracy and the demonstrations after the 2004 Madrid train bombings. Demography the most recent official census by the Instituto Nacional de Estadística, as January 1, 2011, gave a population of 2,558,463 representing 5.42% of the population of Spain. As of January 2011 the population of Castile and Leon, by province, stood as follows. Avila, 172,704 inhabitants, Burgos, 375,657, Leon, 497,799, Palencia, 171,668, Salamanca, 352,986, Segovia, 164,169, Soria, 95,223, Valladolid, 534,874, and Zamora, 193,383. The population density, based on 2011, is 27.15 per square kilometer, less than a third of the national average of 93.51 per square kilometer. Depopulation in the mid-20th century even before the Spanish Civil War. The rural areas of present-day Castile and Leon were losing population due to emigration to Spain's large cities and abroad. 
This trend accelerated in the decade immediately after the Civil War, the growth of a strong industrial center in Valladolid, including Spain's first automobile factory, the Renault plant led by the soldier and engineer Manuel Jiménez Alfaro, mitigated, but did not stop. The emigration. In both the 1960s and 1980s, the urban nuclei and provincial capitals gained population, but the region as a whole still suffered a net loss. To this day, the region has an aging population and a low birth rate contrasted against a merely average death rate by national standards. Present-day population distribution In 1960 only 20.6% of the population of present-day Castile and Leon was urban. By 1991 that percentage had risen to 42.3%. The decline in rural population has apparently been somewhat stemmed, with a 1998 statistic showing 43%. Many rural areas became very sparsely populated in the mid to late 20th century. In 1986 there were seven times as many municipalities with less than 100 inhabitants as in 1960. Notable cities include the nine provincial capitals plus Mirandid Herebro and Arandida do Aero in the province of Burgos. Pomferrada in San Andres del Rey Bunda in Leon, Bayar in Salamanca, and Medina del Campo and Laguna de Duero in Valladolid. Of the 2,247 municipalities in the autonomous community, the 2000 census shows 1,970 with 1,000 or fewer inhabitants, 234 between 1,001 and 5,000, 20 between 5,001 and 10,000, 10 between 10,001 and 20,000, 6 between 20,001 and 50,000, 3 between 50,001 and 100,000, and 4 with over 100,000 inhabitants. Those last are Valladolid, Burgos, Salamanca and Leon. At the other extreme, Blasconano de Matacabras has a population of 18, Rianaso has 24, Villamontero de Campos has 14, and Gormas 17.